Now, let us derive an expression for conductivity of a semiconductor in terms of mobility. Suppose we have a cylindrical conductor, semiconductor like this. In any semiconductor, there, there will be electron and a hole. A negatively charged electron and a positively charged hole. These two are the charge carriers in any semiconductor. So, the total current I will be due to the current due to electron and current due to holes. Suppose we applied an electric field of magnitude E across the conductor. Let's say A be the cross sectional area of the conductor and L be the length of the conductor. This one is the cross sectional area and L be the length of the conductor. Then we have the expression for the current I is equal to number density N into cross sectional area A into charge Q, charge of the carrier Q into drift velocity of the charge carrier. We already derived this expression. If you have any doubt, you can go and check the video. So, current is equal to number density into cross section into charge of the carrier into drift velocity. So, the current due to electron IE will be number density of the electron into cross section area. You know the charge of the electron will be E and let's say the drift velocity of the electron be V. So, let's write IE is equal to N A E V E where this N is the number density means the num number of electrons per unit volume. Now the current due to the hole I H is equal to number density of the holes let's say P be the number density of the holes which means the number of holes per unit volume. Cross sectional area remains the same for both electrons and holes because it is the uh, it, because they both are in the same conductor of cross section area A. Charge of the electron and hole remains the same, so it is E itself, and drift velocity of the holes, let's say that be VH. So this is equal to, so you can write this equation as IH equal to P A E into VH. So this is equal to, you can take the A and E outside because that is common for both the terms then uh, N V E plus P V H. Let us call this as equation number 1. Now by the definition of drift, let me erase this. Now by the definition of drift velocity or definition of mobility, let us say mobility mu mobility is the ratio of drift velocity to the applied electric field e so that the drift velocity vd will be mobility into electric field therefore the drift velocity of electron ve is equal to mobility of the electron into electric field and Drift velocity of holes will be mobility of the holes into electric field. Electric field being the same for both electrons and holes. Let us call this as equation number 2 and let us call this as equation number 3. You can substitute 2 and 3 in the equation 1. So, I will be A E times N into instead of V E you can write mobility of electron into E plus P into mu H into E. Now this E is common, you can take that out. So it will be A E into E times N mu E plus P mu H. Let us call this as equation number 4. Now on the left hand side of the equation, we have the current I. So, by Ohm's law, from Ohm's law, from Ohm's law, 
we have voltage is equal to I into R. Therefore, I is equal to V divided by R. But you know, voltage will be V is equal to electric field times length. Electric field into length give, gives the voltage. E L. Also, the resistance R is equal to resistivity into length of the conductor by cross-sectional area. So, R will be rho L divided by A. So, that this L and this L will get cancelled. So, I is equal to this A will go up. So, E A divided by rho. Let's call this as equation number 5. And you can substitute the value or, or the equation 5 in equation 4. So, that the left side this will become E A divided by rho is equal to a e into e times number density s that is n e into mu e plus p into mu h cancel this e and also this cross section area so that 1 by rho is equal to e into n into mu e plus p into mu h but you know that is you know the reciprocal of resistivity 1 by rho will be the conductivity sigma conductivity conductivity of the material of the conductor therefore instead of 1 by rho you can write sigma that is conductivity is equal to e into n into mu e plus p into mu h. So, this is the expression for the conductivity of a semiconductor in terms of mobility.